In this video, I'm going to show you how to replace the upstream O2 sensors on this Chevy Silverado 2500. Let's get into it. Towards the top of the frame on the passenger side, you're going to see where the connector is. I'm just going to disconnect the connector. There's a little lock tab on here. You want to pull that off. Then pull the lever. and disconnect the connector. Now this connector is not attached to anything, but it could be attached to the frame. You might need a trim tool, just pop it off. Using a O2 sensor socket, basically a 22 millimeter socket with a slice in it, or a 7 8 We're gonna go on the O2 sensor. There we go. I can do that by hand. And slide it out. Take the new one, line it up. Get it started. And tighten it down. If you can get a torque wrench in there, you want to torque that to 31 foot-pounds. And we'll connect the connector. Just line that up. Plug it in. Take that little locking tab. Slide that through. Then you want to secure it. And on the top of the frame, there is a place where you can push the retainer. Slide that in place. When only the best will do, demand TRQ. The only company that lets you view before you do. TRQ is committed to offering the highest quality aftermarket auto parts that are engineered for peace of mind. Thanks for using and viewing with TRQ.